Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So back in June, I posted letting you know that Bing Chat will be integrated into the context and mini menus a lot more in the future in Microsoft Edge for desktop. And just to do a quick recap for the purpose of this video, if we highlight some text in the mini menu, we can see that in the preview versions of Edge, Microsoft is testing the Ask Bing AR option right from uh, the mini menu. And if we click on the three dotted menu, which opens up the um, context menu, we can see the same option, Ask Bing AR, is available. And if we click on that, obviously, it opens up um, that selected text into the Bing Chat Web Copilot in the site panel. Now, it seems that Microsoft, once again, has worked on this feature a little bit since I last posted. And if we head over to one or two screenshots provided by Leo, once again, over on X, we can see now that... The Ask Bing AR, how it currently is, as an example, in Edge Dev. In Edge Canary, um, the entry in the mini menu and also in the context menu has been renamed to Ask Copilot. So if we head to the next screenshot provided, we can see uh, in the context menu as well, Ask Bing AR, Ask Copilot. And it seems that Microsoft is battling to actually make up their mind what they want to call this because originally it was called Ask Bing Chat, then it was called Ask Bing AI, and now it's called Ask Copilot. And obviously that's because uh, Microsoft is calling um, um, the Bing Chat in the side panel of the Copilot for the web. And then we also get the Windows Copilot, which is rolling out as part of the Moment 4 feature update for Windows 11. And we can also see that the icon, I don't know if you can pick that up in the video, but we can see that the icon is looking very similar to what it does in Windows Copilot for the desktop. So it seems now that Microsoft may be deciding on an actual name and an actual um, icon for uh, the Bing Chat integration into the mini menu and the context menu. And I just wanted to bring it to your attention um, if you are following new features in Microsoft Edge. And as far as I know, uh, these options are not available as yet in the stable version, but I think there's a good chance that this is going to make its way down to stable in the near future. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.